Which card do you want to open? Uh, Showdown of the Scouts, please. Showdown of the Scouts or Halvar or both. But where's my... I've got a Valky. We have a Valky. Okay. Hey man, a few decent cards here. I'm not sure if we have a deck. We have a Valky and a Predator. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we're chilling. We're chilling, guys. We're chilling. All right, this card goes in no matter what we're playing. Dude, it's so hard to build it. Like, this view is just awful, isn't it? Like... Jesus, it sucks. Two village rights. Okay, blue, unplayable. So we're definitely playing black, red. The question is, are we... Are we playing any white or any green as well? Probably not. Good luck. We have this land if we go for a little bit of green. Pretty nice. The Draugr's actually not that good, though. It's a bit annoying, but... Caesar Spoils is fine. The Giant and the Haji Mob are also fine, but they're a bit shit, honestly. Man, we have to play green, huh? I don't. I really. I don't want to play green, man. Do not want to play green. Because we can't. We've got all these. We have so many. We've got two double black spells and two spells that are red, uh, red black and double red as well. Fuck me. Not like this, dude. Not like this.
Guess you would have to play Horizon Seeker for playing green. Don't really like that 5-5. Five, five. We only have one hammer Daylight. for the rune. Three snow basics. It's not really enough for a priest. Uh, and a veil, that's four. Can we play Sculptor with four Snowlands? Ugh, don't know. We just have, we have so little two drops, man. It's like horrendous. Ring, a ring is so bad, guys. So, so bad. I have a perfectly fine Rakdos deck. Why add green? I mean, I don't, I actually don't have enough cards. I, I, I literally don't have enough cards to fill out a deck without the green. I don't want to play the green, man. That's two, five, nine. Uh. 15, 17, 19, 21. Yeah, I mean, <clears throat> I've added every single, like, playable card and sketchy card to our Rakdos and we can't fill out the deck. It, it would have to be exactly this with 17 lands. 17 lands is okay with the Seas of Spoils, I guess, but God, there are some bad cards in this deck. But I like it better than Jundo. <clears throat> Grow Splash Black. Also seems kind of bad to... We have to give up our crippling fear to do that, right? It's kind of awkward. Go Gary Splash Red. No, dude, our, our red cards are way better than our black ones. <clears throat> okay, so basically this would be Rakdos. Guys, I, I really hate that I can't, like, I can't save this, you know? Like, could I save this deck and then make another one and so I can actually compare them reasonably? I'm gonna have to fucking take a screenshot, man. Ridiculous. Mm, 
We actually can't play the the snow stuff, huh? Without without black. Oh man, dude, this is so irritating. We've got like 90, 95% of two different decks, but we don't quite have 100% of any deck. It's absolutely brutal. Fuck me. This isn't that bad. Yeah, I mean, the Rakdos deck's not that bad either, though. Alright, I mean, we're not playing Harold. So I don't know why that's there. <coughs> mm Don't know, guys. I'm not sure. I am not sure at all. <laughs> it's a tough one, huh? Nah, you're not allowed to play any games, man. You've got to just...
Yeah, Grixis is possible, huh? We get another Snowland with Grixis too. Mm -mm. Another Rune. The Harbinger would be good. For fuck's sake, man. <laughs> I'm so triggered. Alright, screenshot this deck. <clears throat> Mm -mm. Can't play. We don't have any lands for Mardu, man. We can't play Mardu. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm I mean... <laughs> this does not look horrendous. We lose our two lands though. Just, like we lose the slumber mound and our elder hods, which is really bad. Guys, I don't know what to play, man. I don't know if it's Grixis. I mean, this card is really, really strong. This one. I don't know if it's Grixis. I don't know if it's Gruul. I don't know if it's... Uh, Rakdos. I, I don't know if it's literally Force Boros, Splash Predator, and Valky. I, I don't know what to play, man. No idea. Just Rakdos. I mean, this kind of looks good, though, no? It looks good to me. Mm Golgari, I'm not playing Golgari, guys. I'm not. I'm not giving up. Frostbite, Demon Bullet, and Squash. No chance. <clears throat> You can splash, squash, and bolt. Well, then it's not Golgari, is it? If we're 
Golgari splash squash bolt frostbite predator and Valkyrie is not Golgari. That's fucking jund, man. That's a different deck. We can probably play Shackles with two village rights, huh? Yeah, the curve is triggering me, man. The curve, the curve is triggering me a little bit. I mean, we do we do have Demon Bolt for Tell, which is relevant. Doomscar Titan for Tell. So the curve's more like this. Seize the spoils can get us to these uh, fives and sixes. It would at least be a deck that can cast a hammer. It would at least be a deck that can cast their double black spells. I don't know I don't know if I'm feeling this over the like the gruel splash black though. The gruel splash black just looks a bit better, right? Crippling Fear is a mega bomb, yeah, but we can we cannot play Crippling Fear in the Gross Splash Black version. I think it's between these two guys. I don't think we want to play full junt. It's just straight Rakdos or well, you also get these you also get to play these two Elder Halls and the Slumber Mound in this deck, which is a massive plus point. The downside is our, we're going to lose a game to mana. At least one. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, if, if, there's, if there's a matchup where Crippling Fear is good, it's best of three, right? So we can just sideboard into Rakdos if we need that cripple and fear badly. I think I'm going to go with the grow, man.
Do we want the boat or the carve on this deck? We can't... We can't really crew the carve, man. I don't think we want them. All right, we can have two. We have three snowlands if we play basic swamp. Or play a snow swamp. I don't think that's enough. It's definitely not enough for Sculptor. I don't even think it's enough for the Blessing. We do have three three-power creatures, though, where one Snowland would be enough to get a draw. Yeah, I think we play it. <coughs> I'm not playing Glitter and Frost or Rip Getting Ring, man. It's no chance. Not in this scroll deck. <clears throat> This is great banter. It really is. All right, how many sources of black do we need, man? That's the question here. At the moment, we have two plus the two sees the spoils. I don't think we can play that sculptor, guys. With only four snowlands, it's so sketch. Oh yeah, we have two Caesar Spoils plus Horizon Seeker. Okay. I think we have to play three swamps, huh? That's just so many, man. It's making me upset. <clears throat> Gotta be three that yikes. <clears throat> That's four four black lands, one horizon seeker, two seize the spoils. Uh we have rune to draw, frost to draw. Okay. 
We, also, we need some black sources for our Elder Halls anyway, right? So it's not the end of the world. We have two Elder Halls, so making sure we can actually use them is quite important. <clears throat> and then we have to cut a card from the deck, man. Cut a card. Oh yeah, the struggles also are foretell, huh? So we do have a lot of stuff we can do on turn two. Very nice. Unpack, mate. We have two giants and two shapeshifters for our squash. I think maybe cut just one of these five fives, or or the Haji mob, or the just this fucking dumbass guy. The dumbass guy is a bit annoying. Stop hating on the pup. Dude, we're playing the pup, man. Yeah, Ma Mammoth Growth is not an incredible card, but we do have some decent creatures to use that on. <clears throat> we have some creatures with Trampo. We have uh, Flyers. We've got Hammer. Uh, our creatures will have counters on them with Struggle. Got a trample run. We have a lot of reasonable targets for the mammoth growth. I think it's fine. But it might, it might have to be that though, huh? Because I don't think we can cut any creatures. We need this hammer. Frostbite and Veil are nice. Bolt, struggle, run. Or got our draw removal spell. Yeah, it has to be the mammoth growth, I think. <clears throat> it has to be that. Alright, we go with this, guys. Monkaius. One sec. Okay, chat. Are we happy? So the only cards that are even borderline playable that we don't have already are Sculptor, which is pretty borderline, the Saga. It's pretty borderline. Harold is uncastable. There's also the Raiders Carve. So these two Raiders Carve, I guess you could consider you could consider Draugr. I mean Draugr is not a two mana play. So it's just these. These are the only ones that we could play that we don't have. And Mammoth Growth, I guess. <coughs> I don't really think we want any of these over the cards that are already in our deck. Maybe the Saga, but... I don't mind the Saga. But the saga would have to come in for a different uh, non-creature spell. We need to seize the spoils to cast our cards. And then everything else is just rune and removal spells, right?
We should try and find a way to get this saga, though, no, I think. For blessing, I, I mean, I, I don't. I think the blessing's pretty good, though. No, I think the blessing's one of our best cards. need to cut one of these five drops, man. The Hadji mob or one of the Outriders. Giant's not great either. Nah, no, the Giant's not great either, man. I mean, n none of our expensive our expensive creatures are amazing apart from the Titan. Hand has good cards in it. Cut a seize? We can't cut a seize, man. A seize is there to help us cast our spells. If we're cut, the only thing you can cut seize for is the glitter and frost or the replicate and ring. Makes no difference. Our cards are very expensive, guys. Good lord. <clears throat> That saga is completely nuts.
I don't know if I've ever beaten that saga in Limited, man. <clears throat> like, in draft or sealed. I've still, I've never managed to draft it myself either. It's so insane, man. Uh, This giant is just so bad, huh? <clears throat> this unbelievably expensive. Could kill the pet there, but I'm not giving up making my hammer to just uh, kill that dumbass thing. <clears throat> Alright, Fortel Andrew. Have we both sideboarded into control decks or what? <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
Yeah, Draugr's instant speed. Rakdos control men are coming through it. Okay, nice. Two berserkers. I don't think there's no instant speed berserkers, right? Is Jarl a berserker? <coughs> no, this is worth it because this is this is the only way I can remove that, stop them getting a draw, and still have the mana to hold up Draugr, right? Because we want to cast Draugr now. Draugr's got two two berserkers in their graveyards: the giant and the Aji mob. Okay, it's not it's not a berserker. Nice. Saga's their best card. Taking them off their best card while enabling errors is absolutely worth it. Well, I think pass is fine. Probably should be playing this Valky as a creature, by the way, but, you know. Greed Lord.
I hate our creatures, man. They're just they're so they're so expensive. I can't even fucking cast them. It's ridiculous. But luckily we have a nice hand to play around that somewhat. <clears throat> that is a good one though. I don't think we saw any hasters, right? I mean, if they cast a haster and attack our, our Tebo, so be it. I don't know, man. I don't know. I think this is the turn to start playing our creatures out, because we could happily take a hit from either of these guys. <clears throat> I would really like to have... T I don't really care about Tebow. I just need it alive for one more turn so I can use them to find the land. So that I can do a uh, giant squash. <clears throat> if it dies after this turn, it's... I don't, I don't care. We should have enough after that. I mean, we might have to minus the table next turn if, in some situations, but I would really like to plus for a land. I'm surprised they didn't put the flying on the Berserker. I guess they just don't have any spells to cast. <clears throat>
Very, I played this game insanely slow. What a Gandalf, man. I mean, we've got some good cards in our hand. <clears throat> At least they're good when you've got nine mana. Not so good before that, though. Run it back, baby. What was the foretell? It was the return upon the tides, whatever it's called. Get a creature back. So they have that and Draugr. So we just keep getting their creatures with their... Keep getting their creatures with their dragon if we can. Well, I don't mind that big fucking dumbass being on the bottom of our deck. It's fine by me. I mean, I think a slow game suits us, kind of, right? Or it should do, anyway. Not every time, though, of course. The problem with using Bolt here is that I can't cast any card that I draw next turn. 
if I have to hold up the stupid feed. It's so mana inefficient as well. Did we see anything from them that Bolt actually doesn't kill? I don't think so. Not so far, anyway. Okay. Well, we didn't draw anything anyway, so rip. I have to actually play my land first, because that thing has a trigger. Please auto tap correctly, nice. <clears throat> Alright, that's our worst card. Don't really want to draw your worst card, but it's fine. It seems flooded. I think they've got their recursion spells, right? Could be that shadow thing, but I mean, they, would, they wouldn't, they wouldn't play their creature out though. I think it's okay to bolt after blocks, right? Titan has tramples, so... <clears throat> I don't even know if I want to waste this, guys. <clears throat> Bolt on the Faithful could be lethal, but if it's not lethal, 
and we're like, what, there's six cards going to the graveyard here, we're enabling all their graveyard stuff and we don't have our bolt. Seems like a scam. This way, the graveyard stuff gets gets enabled, so does ours, and we still have the boat. And we get to play two creatures, which isn't bad. Yeah, they only got one here, so that's fine. I mean, we're definitely going to win this game. I just need to make sure I don't throw it somehow. Doesn't really seem that throwable though, huh? Right, guys, we have we have trample, man. We have lethal through the life linker anyway, so we don't need to get rid of that. We just get rid of their best creature, right? I mean, if we didn't have a hammer in play, I would bolt the faithful, obviously. Less than three means you less than three. Okay. Whoop. How's it going, man? All right. We're playing right dusted. Good lord. <clears throat> Time to swap the deck. <laughs> Classic green scam. Insert witty comment that will make chat laugh. They're the only friends I have. All right, what card did we play? Oh, the, we play the shackles with the village, right? So. <clears throat> the vault robber is so bad, man, but. Mm-mm. 
The rest of these cards also bad, to be fair. The Kettle Master is decent, but our deck is already expensive enough. Oh, we have a Scornef. We have the colorless cards, huh? Yeah. Scorn Effigy may be better than the robber. It's like another turn to play anyway, right? Kennel Master's better than the Giant. Kennel Master is decent, but I like to play it we have to cut one of the other expensive cards, right? Can't cut one of the cheaper cards here. Yeah. I just don't think it's that good, man. I think the Kennel Master and the Giant are both pretty bad, right? So we're gonna have to play one of them that are bad. At least the giant makes her squash cheaper on turn nine. Uh, I guess five drops play a bit better with the seize the spoils as well. This snow swamp should just be a normal swamp, huh? Play around Redanes. Mm -mm -mm. I need that for Valky. What? When you steal a creature that requires snow. Okay. Honestly, that is more likely than playing against a Redain. So yeah, I'll play it. I don't even know if you're memeing, but even by memeing you've said something genuinely correct. <clears throat> but it's, it's far more likely that we play Valky and steal a snow creature than our opponent has exactly Redain. I'll take it. Yep. <clears throat> Alright, chat. Six wins to go. Pretty easy. I think this is a keep. We're on the draw, we have Frostbite, we have our two best cards. They've taken a mull? Okay, I'll definitely keep them now. Easy. <coughs> Easy. Another Rakdos, Andrew, potentially. 
Yep. It's Rakdos all the way down, baby. Alright, what you got, dude? Another one with this fucking saga, dude. Are you serious? How do they all have the saga, man? This could honestly be just a crippling fear, man. I don't, I don't see the problem. I see no problem. Crippling fear, clear their board, hold up village rights, drain for three. Protect from protect our predator. They have uh, they had some sort of instant speed spell with four mana, or up to four mana. <clears throat> this is a I mean it's not the greatest crippling fear we're going to cast today but it's the card we're casting creatures that aren't of the chosen type okay not elves get minus three minus three I, th I think they have exactly Feed the Serpent or another 4 mana instant speed spell. Because it's, it doesn't cost 3 or less, it costs exactly 4 or whatever it is. <clears throat> that's, that's not the card they had, it's, they've got another one. I don't know what other four mana instants there are, but I mean, I assume it's Feed the Serpent. Ah, trolls, okay. Hi, just doing my part in this high quality stream. If it's a Trolls and a Feed the Serpent, then, well, rip us, but I think that's, once they cast that spell we knew they had, that's our cue to slam the dude.
We just want to try and take them off, like, raise the Draugr, right? Try and take them off, being able to get two creatures back. I mean, we're, we're never going to be able to get all of their creatures out of the graveyard, but... Try and make it sure that they can only get one, at least. Well, I mean, our deck is definitely better than theirs, but they do have the best card, so... See what we can do. <clears throat> Skull red, huh? I'm not sure we want to sideboard. Don't think any of these cards improve our deck here. Maybe the robber is better than the effigy in this matchup. Second sees the spoils could be a bit greedy. Maybe play just play the giant instead. <clears throat> I think I'll do that. All right, chat. This is, this is hard, man. This requires my full brain power. That I am not a limited Andy, at least not yet. Okay. Two mana, one three. I'll take it. Land drops secured. <clears throat> I think we just do it again, guys. Just swap our crippling fear for their reinforcements and some time. It's got the name Rogue, right? Did we see any village rights from them in game one? I can't remember. I don't. I don't think so. If 
feel like I should still just squash this now, though. Don't really have a choice but to play this. It's just it's so bad. We know they have at least one squash. If they have the giant and the squash, then maybe we have enough time to grow this predator big enough. Squash kills their own giant? Well, I mean, it's only only cost two mana, right? They can play another creature first. They've got they've got seven mana, the three cards. I guess we take the one damage here, right? So what other... I can't remember what cards they have on their deck, man, for fuck's sake. Squash. There was the trolls as well, huh? Trolls. Yeah. I think it's a block.
I was considering blocking with my dragon, man, and just getting the dragon back with one of my droggers. But it's a bit pussy, isn't it? A little bit pussy, if you ask me. <clears throat> Alright, one moment, guys. 2 oh, good start, good start. <clears throat> I like that we just played the two-color deck that I knew was the best deck to play instead of doing dumbass splash shit. One sec. <clears throat> I kicked the desk. Wow, the streamer is finally on the play for the first time today. Rakdos again? What? That's three out of three. I get maybe they could be playing more than two colors, but. We really need some land studs. <sighs> we missed the land again and now this braggart will get out of range of her fear. That's so dumb man. Is that really going to decide this game? Fuck me, man.
Okay, dude, I'm mega tilted about that. Costs us like the one missed black costs us not only twelve life, but they also gain twelve life because of that. It's actually triggered. Oh, I gain eight life. Sorry, costs us twelve life, and they gain eight. Next turn, we name Scarecrow. Right, we start the game on four life, guys. Seems pretty fair and balanced. At least we got to start, yeah. Could have easily been dead there. I'm scared. That's quite a lot of good cards. I think we play the dragon, huh? Their opponent's deck looks strong. Very strong.
depends what they do. I, I mean, I assume that they're going to play Clarion Spirit and Furia this turn. And I guess they have to play the Clarion Spirit first, right? So they don't get a draw. Yeah. <clears throat> That's fine. You lose the Necromancer. <clears throat> Opponent's deck is bomb sitted. Wow. What is this fucking ridiculous greed? Dead to a removal spell? Removal spell one time. Frost bite, demon bolt, dwarven hammer, shackles of treachery, Carder's vicious return. Valky. Punish one time. Wizards, please bless me. Uh, what? Wait, aren't they just dead anyway? I'm so confused. Are they just dead anyway? No, they take three. They take three and lose their board, kind of. Block, block. But what am I missing here? What am I missing? Why did they play like this? What am I missing? One white. <clears throat> I guess they can, they can have Iron Verdict, huh? Okay. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. 
Okay, so I don't need to exile like my own creature here, huh? Oh my god. Oh my god, no. Oh my fucking god, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I oh my god. I read the card and I was like, what can I do here? Can I use village rights? Do I have to eat my own creature? Oh wait, it doesn't work. Okay. That's fine, that's fine. Jesus Christ. Magic is too hard, guys. What is with the rules of this game? They're making no sense, man. Oh, I was panicking for a second there. I mean, to be fair, if they ca if they cast that one up, I wasn't worried about the Kennel Master. I was worried about them getting to cast the... The... Where is it? <clears throat> the Doomscar Titan. But Kennel Master, it would have been annoying to give them a free card. But... Because <clears throat> the Doomscar Titan would have left us uh, dead. A lot of the time. Trickery is just a hobby. Chaos is my career. Guys, their deck is unbelievable, man. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Absolutely unbelievable. We still got the shackles in our deck, but shackles. Perfect mana as well. Yeah, it's hard, isn't it? It's hard. Also got the ruined crown and the rune, huh? The rune's still in the deck, by the way. Classic. Best rune. Yep. Looking worried? I mean, that this is that this is the best deck we'll play against today, man. It doesn't matter. I don't care what decks are at when we go go six one, and we're playing final boss. The deck's gonna be worse than this, so it's fine. I mean, this might be the best deck we play against in the entirety of the Cal Time experience. Mm. 
We're fighting, but I'm doing my best. <clears throat> I really wish that I queued up for this match like three seconds later or earlier, so I didn't have to play against this guy. No friggin' cap. This is the same game that we took an extra 12 damage for no reason as well, by the way. Seems pretty cool. Is it possible for me to draw one damage? Shackles and card door, huh? Car door. Because I could frostbite my own dwarf here. Pretty risky though, huh? 2 and 12. Seems like a scam. We have 1 and 6 draw for lethal. Oh yeah, shit, the Predator's got lifelink anyway. Okay. I forgot about, forgot about the ruined crown and the rune on top of everything else. Classic. Even his mills are good, that's absolutely nuts. There is still a Valky in our deck. There's still a Valky in our deck, smile.
Okay, so we sack here, right? Because my swing back is not enough to stay alive for the turn, so... <clears throat> There's seven cards in our deck. We mill three if we sack. One of them is Valkyrie. There's got to be some math there. Because mm -mm -mm. I, I have to draw Valkyrie this turn. Does, does sacking or not sacking give me the highest chance at Valkyrie? It's exactly the same, right? It really is exactly the same. I decline. <laughs> Dude, we had an out, man. After all that, we had an out. So giant good tier. I don't think we want smash him, man. Definitely a consideration, but I don't think we want it. Scout only hits artifacts, man. Or smashing, sorry. <clears throat> only hits artifacts. So it only removes the crown. Crown is good, but... We actually have a timer problem, guys. We've only got 14 minutes left, man. <laughs> 14 minutes, by the way.
Guess we play the, the mob over the hammer here. The hammer creature is a bit terrible. They must be able to make another token here if they're attacking with that token. Wow. No? What? I'm very surprised that they didn't make another token there. That was kind of weird. <laughs> Do I, I get a trigger off of this, right? Bag out trigger. Okay, good cards, good cards. Very nice cards. I could have got a trigger off of the Furia if I played my Valkyrie as a creature, but doesn't seem like that's worth it. Do not foretell the scorn effigy. Fuck me. <clears throat> Why not? Because... Well... What if I draw a bomb, right? And I'm forced to draw Valky or a bomb. Stage 2 of the saga is... Each player discards a card.
Game three, baby! One sec, guys, this, this is an absolutely crazy. Fuck me, man. Okay, dude. <clears throat> I've got to say, guys, this is absolute gas. This is up there with my all-time magic experiences. We are not. We're not up against the house of a dick here, man. We're up against a street. We're up against an entire city of a dick. It is unbelievable. <clears throat> yeah, we have a small time problem, but it's okay. Do we ever save the score in effigy because we're... <sighs> Saving it, because they have a lot of like, make two spells, you know? Like, because we have shackles in hand, but I mean, it seems terrible to save it. So it's far, that's far, far off. <laughs> Death by a pillow, thanks for 10 subs, man, appreciate that, dudes. Like Furia, Clarion Spirit, these type of things, but I can't even steal them until I find a village rights anyway. <coughs> this is great That's a block answer. we take here. It really is. Interesting block. <coughs> <laughs> this is great answer. It really is. This is great banter. It really is. <clears throat> I have to fucking squash that thing, don't I? Jesus. I have to. <laughs> this is great. I have to squash that really piece is. of shit. Are you serious? It really is. Looks like this might be their iron verdict. Ah, oh, the poison the cup, okay. <clears throat> Top <laughs> Top. Red source Falke. Popped, not a red source, huh? That is interesting. Mm -hmm. Alright, Trample Dragon coming through. Okay, 
relevant word, trample. Do we want to sack the Comus Faithful? Is that worth it for us? Not sure. Village rights? Well, if we draw village rights, we'll be using shackles, right? And sacking via that. I guess we have we have car doors, vicious return, huh? So we'll hold. Car door. I got a cast that spell, I guess. Cast that one. <clears throat> Come on, Tebo. Okay, this is a little bit offensive, honestly. I mean, their deck's pretty good. I'm a little bit upset by what's currently happening. It's a good one. What? That is... Has this opponent just, like, rigged the whole fucking thing? He's got this insane deck... I've got this Tebo in play, I can't use like, it's not doing anything. What the fuck is going on here? <clears throat> Do we ult the Tebo? I mean surely, right? <laughs> surely, yes. Honestly, we could we could plus it again, man. <laughs> We go again. The world tree will be king of Koltan's pile. I've I actually I have a genuine time problem though, guys. I'm not gonna lie.
Dennis. Dude, I can't. I can't even see what's going on, man. I can't see. There's too many cards. I should. I real. I just. I realized after I cast the first spell that I should have played Clarion Spirit. I didn't even know those Clarion Spirits were there. I. D I didn't even know they were there, dude. There's like way too much shit. That it's all shiny and stuff. I can't see anything. Time? Uh, the time the time is not a problem, I don't think. I just have to I'm trying to keep reminding myself to do not cast the furrier or the comas. Do not cast the furriers or the comas. Ever. Got there, dude. Holy fuck, man, that was hard. <laughs> Missed two damage. Dude, if I caught your name there, I would have fucking insta perma banned you, you prick. What do you mean, missed two damage? What the fuck are you talking about, man? I've just been sitting there for like an hour playing against a guy who's not. He's not. 
he's not even playing a fucking constructed deck. That deck would win constructed tournaments. Who the fuck are you fuck? Jesus Christ. We found a way to get around it. And it missed two damage. Shut the fuck up, man. What is wrong with you, dude? What the hell is wrong with you?